Thomas Watson was one of the Puritans uh, who lived in the 1600s when the Westminster Assembly met and uh, they wrote the Westminster Shorter Catechism, the Longer Catechism, and the Confession of Faith. Uh, some people think they are reformed when they have come to see that uh, God is sovereign in some ways, but there was a lifestyle to the Puritans, and they deeply believed in catechizing their children. Um, some people have missed the point that they began very early to train their children in sound doctrine, not, not by doctrinal dissertations, but by catechism questions that were very brief, but foundational to the understanding of the world and of God and of the gospel. And uh, that is a method that is so useful to this day, to those who want to have a Christian household and want their children to grow up in the fear of God. You can't leave the job to other people, even good pastors <laughs> or teachers in the church, but the daily instruction of these questions and the repetition of answering them, children then grow up having no memory of the days they didn't know these things and are surprised when the world around them has no comprehension of those, those doctrines. And as a now a great-grandfather, I can tell you that great-grandfathers are thrilled when uh, a little child is learning to talk and uh, the parents are teaching already the catechism and they know the answers to the early questions in it.